Oh my God, he made a bubble nest. Look at that. Oh, you wanna have some babies? Hell yeah, look at his bubble nest. Oh my God, wow. Actually, super like super super sharp, sharp, cutty. Yeah, cutty. Cutty. Cut. Very cutty. <laughs> they cut valve thin. Don't know what the actual name is or the common name. Okay. Yeah. Ambulia. They look nice as well. Again, stick your hands in there. It's fine. Hydro. Hydrophilia. Okay. Time to go get the big boys. I'm so excited, I'm so excited. I went to I went to go to these like fish stores and then I couldn't find anything in the first one or the second one and I went to the surf one in Kingswood and I got myself a giant beta. Holy crap, oh my god, it's so big, it's so pretty. There's so many there. I'm gonna shout out them later, but um just heading back to my car, trying not to die of excitement. Um yeah, it looks really cool. I'm gonna give him a nice home today. Oh my god, he was in such a little small area, but He's gonna be in a nice, nice big tank today. All right, ladies, peace. So here he is. at all the water's a bit murky but it should clear up just because I shifted some stuff around moved all the moss out they don't seem to be stressed out they seem to be having a pretty good time no issues yeah all in food so that's nice slow down the current I need to slow down the current in here as well it's a bit strong but it's not seem to be 
Let's see what it looks like in the middle. Like, oh, look at that. Look at the rooms on the hand. He is a giant koi beta. And he won't look like this all the time. As he grows and, you know, as time passes, his scales will change color, which is so awesome. It means I'll get like another baker in a year. He seems to be having fun. He was a bit scared at first of his home. And he wanted to stay in the corner, but I've covered it all so you can see anything and just explore him. How you doing, buddy? Size in this tank while that big tank over there gets ready. She's uh, he's gonna be my feature fish, so he's gonna be in there. I'm planning. Oh my god, he made a bubble nest! Look at that! Oh, you want to have some babies? Hell yeah, look at his bubble nest! Oh my god, wow! I was just planning. Okay, well. I didn't even see this. This is the first thing I should have seen. But um, I was planning on getting a female beta for our friend here, um, Sai, who is shy and going to the corner there. Um, I'll just turn the light off so it's a bit easier for him. Um, and I was gonna put her in this tank while we were waiting for that to go. And while she was gonna be in this tank, I was gonna redo this entire tank, make it, I feel like I wanna go with the gravel, because um, the sand is nice, but I don't know, it's, it's not matching my aesthetic. I really like this, um, the grain that comes off this uh, rock. So I was gonna escape this, leave the female in here. And once uh, Sai is in there, escape this and put the female in here. And I wanted to breed and have beta babies. And it's good to see that he is in the mood to, to do this. Look at that. Well, yeah, so I'm really excited. He's having a great time. We're gonna have some babies maybe, I don't know, like ages from now, nothing soon. Um, this whole process took like months and months, um, but finally got everything sorted out. I'm like cleaning up my other tanks. This one looks really, really nice now. I like the structure of it. It's gonna be Lali. Lali. And I bought one of these huge Hanubia driftwood pieces to put in here, along with what's finally an almond leaf. I found them um, at a store in um, Auburn called Ausdiscus or Nanotank uh, Australia, which is awesome. And if you want to start out your uh, for your own little beta tanks, I recommend going there because I have every because of them I was able to get this nice little leaf. You can get a nice view from the side there, I think. He's a big boy. There we go. Wow, that came out really nicely. His beautiful colors. Look at those colors, right? Say hi, Sai. His name is Sai. Look, he's coming to look at you guys. <laughs> look, he's not camera shy at all. Oh my god. Oh my god, he's so close. There you go. He's a <clears throat> giant beta. I don't know if he's a koi, I'm not 100% sure. I just know he's a giant and he is beautiful. He's so big and he's enjoying this subpar tank. I'm just keeping him in here and letting him have some fun in here. And then in this tank, 
my little small one. Also got the same stuff going. This, but this tank belongs to my other beta. Her name is Lali. Look at her. She's she looks me. She looks like she's mad, but actually on top of her eyes, there's like scales. And so, well, I think they're scales. And they're like eyebrows. Eyebrows, eyelashes. Eyebrows or eyelashes, eyelids, yeah, eyelids. And so one of them is like a white eyelid. Let me focus in. One of them is a white eyelid, and then the other side is like a 